Hello. Today I'm going to be sowing a pak choy garden. I've never done this before, it's an experiment. So I'm not recommending it. I'm just telling you I'm giving it a shot. And if you follow this channel, you'll see the results in a few months time I would expect when I post a second video. So what we're going to be using to make this garden? Well, some pieces of cardboard that I've already cut. Okay. Hope I can get these back in this uh, crate. And this is a spent mushroom crate. You've seen these before, haven't you? Of course you have. So this is our, uh, this is going to be our Pak Joy garden. What we're going to do is, hopefully, we're going to fill this with compost and sow some Pak Choy in it. Now the compost in the batter is compost I was using yesterday. Uh, and it's compost I made for growing carrots in. And it's basically sold from molehills, uh, recycled spent compost, um, sand, and I've also drizzled some uh, spent coffee grounds in there that I got recently. I don't know if that will work. Uh, you know, I've never used this stuff before. We're going to give it a go. So we're going to make this into our pak choy garden. Okay, right, let's fill it up. And what I'm actually expecting is, this pak choy is going to take a few months to grow and in that few months this cardboard is probably going to start and degrade um, and eventually fall to pieces. But hopefully not until we've harvested the pak choy. Um, and then it doesn't matter does it? Okay, we can always cut some more cardboard next year, can't we? If it works, if it works. Now I've got to tell you what, I'm already liking the look of this. <laughs> And I haven't sown any pak choy yet. How's that looking? Does that look okay? Right. This pak choy, uh, I'm going to be sowing, I think it's seven, seven seedlings in here. And the reason I'm sowing seven is because I started 12 seeds away in a seed tree and only seven germinating. So if I'd got 12, I'd have been planting 12, but I got seven, so I'm planting seven. Right, let me show you those. There you go. Now these have been in modules, as you can tell. You can see the root ball. Um, and I've just popped them out before I started doing this video. And I think there are seven of them. I'll, I'll tell you what there is. There are six... six root balls but that one actually contains two plants uh, so I'll split that one as best I can and make seven plants and we'll try and get them in this um, pak choy garden as evenly spaced as we can I don't know if I'm overcrowding this I might be underfilling it I just don't know excuse me Molly thank you we may get Molly in the shot we may not she's standing off the edge of the camera there yeah, so what we'll do is we'll just place these on top first and try and sort of get them evenly spaced. Okay, now this is the one that has two in. We'll just see if we can't tease this apart. Ah, of course we can. Look at that. Two for the price of one. Okay. Let's get a shot of that. Okay, that's it. Seven pak choy. Do they look evenly spaced? How, how do you evenly space seven? How do you do it? You can't, can you? It's impossible. We'll evenly space six and we'll pop the other one in somewhere. How's that? This is uh, gardening on the hoof, isn't it? <laughs>
return bill, yeah? Seize those guys out a bit. Give us some room in the middle. Pop this guy in the middle. How's that? That's it. Room for everybody. There was room at the inn for everybody. Right. We'll just give these a spray. Uh, no, we won't. We'll give them a light water. That's what we'll do because they're not seeds. They're seedlings. So we'll take a light water. Just hold on. Okay, let me show you this thing. No, oh, that is don't your lemonade bottle, obviously. But what about this guy? We've seen one of these before. We've seen one of those. It's a very small rose and it fits on the top of any drinks bottle. Or more or less any drinks bottle. How's that? And it's very, very fine. Now when I squirt this, you get a fine spray. Are you watching? How's that? How fine is that? Now then, this thing here, I don't know where I got it. Well, I do know where I got it. I got it given. Uh, so I don't know where it come from, apart from a friend gave me it. So if you want one of these, I don't know where you would find one. But I find it really useful because it's such a such a light spray. It's good for doing uh, carrots in pots when, you, when the seedlings are just breaking through. Get a nice fine spray. Okay, so I hope you've enjoyed this video. This is Homegrown Veg, signing out.